Hey guys, okay, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another episode of Car DIY. For today's episode, okay, will be a continuation, okay, of the previous videos. Okay, as you know, okay, a while ago, I actually changed out uh, the speakers, okay, and the woofers, okay, of the BMW. And a lot of you guys, okay, have been asking, you know, did I add in an amplifier? Did I do this? Did I do that? Okay, I did not. Okay, I just swapped the speakers, okay, which is still the factory head unit. Right, so for today's episode, okay, we'll be adding something interesting, okay, which I actually got online, okay, mm -hmm. it is the Puzu. Yeah, this is a DSP, okay, it's a digital sound processor, right, which actually I got online, okay, links will be in the description down below, alright, and it claims that, you know, uh, once you plug it in, you know, you'll, you, 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 I mean, the sound and everything will be much, much better than the stock. Right, so for today's episode, okay, we'll be showing you this, okay, and as well, okay, uh, you have to buy and you have to get the kit as well, okay, for the wires, right, so this one goes to the head unit to replace the other one from the other side, and this one is to a DSP, okay, I'm not sure how, how it works out, okay, that's an instruction manual, we'll be learning, okay, uh, together, okay, in this uh, install, right, so guys, before I start this episode, okay, please remember to like and subscribe, Alright, we'll have more videos like this coming up, more crazy stuff. Right, so without further ado, I'm gonna start this uh, DIY. Alright, so we'll show you some of the before and after, and let's hope that you know the camera actually picks up you know some of the noise difference, that the sound difference and all this because it might not pick up that well. Let's hope it can. Okay, so let's go.
Alright, so guys, okay, that's the end of the whole DIY. The whole DIY actually took less than, I think, less than 30 minutes, okay, because I've been removing this up and down, you know, so it's quite easy for me. Alright, so, and uh, the DSP, right, actually makes so much difference in the sound, right? Uh, I'm not sure if you can pick it up from the before and after, okay, uh, sound clips, okay, but the sound is richer, yep, I. I understand what people say is richer, you know, like last time I used to think, you know what is richer, you know, sound richer. So now I feel, it, it's fuller, you know, you, you feel more of the bass, you feel more of the, the instruments and stuff, okay, which is really amazing because this thing is just a plug and play, you know, DSP and I didn't expect the the difference would be so much, okay, as you can see from the clip, right, I actually get Esther to sit in the car, okay, to test it out, right, she was quite happy with it. Right, that means you know I can have more mods coming up. Right, so guys, okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this one, okay. And this one is, I think it will be just part one, okay, because I have not done the tuning, okay, because it has actually a software, okay, where you can tune the the DSP, okay, to your liking. Uh, I'm not sure how it works, uh, okay, because. I roughly know how it works, you know, uh, so the, the instruments and the sound will be from the, the tweeters and then the mids and then the, the subwoofer, you know, I'll get to that in maybe the next video. Right, so, so far I'm happy with it. Right, so guys, okay, links in the, links to the items are in the, in the description down below. Right, so I hope you guys have enjoyed this one as much as I did. Okay, I'm going to enjoy this for a while because I, I mean, I love listening to radio, you know, when I'm driving, right, and it makes so much of a difference. Alright, so guys, okay, I hope you guys have enjoyed this one. If you like, please smash the like button. Remember to subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Alright, so stay safe, stay healthy, happy modding your car. Bye!